<laughs> Skin. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. First episode of season five. We are back. Holy shit. It's been a long time since yeah. we've done this. Yeah, it's been a while. A lot has happened since November. It's been a hot minute, Matt. The floor sucks. <laughs> <laughs> There's like I'm two. Not, I'm not even trying to be funny. Like the floor sucks. My arms hurt. My back sore. <laughs> I have to sit in a position. You so got my toys, knees. and you're in my vomit. And at least we have a we have a couch that reclines. Oh man, this. At is... least we have that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, we've upgraded, and this couch is. Fucking yeah, good. look at this, man. Best idea Marty has had in a long look time. Look at that. See, now, oh. now we, now we're lying down. So we've redone the set, and mm. let me. Does that mean your feet are like blocking me now? Let <laughs> me, <laughs> let me draw your gaze. There you go, man. Is that better? Let yeah, me draw your gaze you. to this bottle here. You may have seen our promo video. Now, over the break, right? Matt made a huge discovery. Matt, where did you find that bottle? So. We thought we lost it in the move. Yeah. But um, I actually had stuck it in one of my backpacks. And yeah, in the front of backpacks, sometimes they've got like a little extra zipper where you can slide a, like a little pocket in there. Ah! <laughs> uh. And that's where Matt found his bottle of mints. All right. This is <sighs> like, we, I don't know if we're allowed to say it. It's cunt. No, 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 no. He's no, filled no, it with don't cum. Don't say that. Fucking cunt. Fuck off. Seriously, we we need to start working on not oh. swearing in the first Look, three let's minutes. Just, let's That's just why we're the most demonetized. Why don't we have wireless shit yet? Fuck me. Stay on track. We're talking about the cum hey, bottle. Sorry, sorry. Look, this bottle Invest is filled with Matt's cum. All right. He spent a good six months, was it? Ejaculating into this bottle over and over. Th this is a this is real. All right. This is not we haven't we haven't replaced this with something else. It is legit. We don't First the cum bottle. I mean, so first the Stop. golly bottle. <clears throat> now we have the cum bottle. I don't know if I'm comfortable telling everyone about this. All right, look, we're going to- We forced you to do it, so just blame yeah, it I on know, us. But now I'm like- And also, look- Mum. Just so you know, viewers, we will be referring to this bottle as Matt's mince bottle. We need to. Because if we keep saying that it is what it is, then the videos will get removed, okay? Because you can't have a bottle of ejaculate just sitting on the set. It will get removed for all sorts of different reasons. What about the calm bottle? The calm No, 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 no. We shouldn't even go near it. Mince. Sticks to mince. It's Matt's mince bottle right there. But we just wanted to address it because we want you to know that that is real. And there is a segment, the Matt versus Michael segment, because they both desire this cum bottle more than anything else. Sorry, mince bottle. And during this season's season finale, one of them will win Matt's mince bottle to do with whatever they please. <laughs> yeah. During the finale. Ooh. Why? Why do you want it? I don't know. It looks cool. It's beautiful. There's a lot of work's gone into that. <laughs> Cut that, Connor. Do not say how many loads. It's a <laughs> by the way. Yeah, Connor. Cut Matt mentioning how many loads. We're a not lot of a lot of effort has gone into that. Yes, model. we're not going to tell you how many loads because we're going to have a competition to see if anyone can guess the exact amount of loads in that bottle. So. We want you to comment how many loads. This is kind of like the the jelly bean. How many jelly beans in the jar game? How many loads of mints are in that mince bottle? Oh, how comment many how many you think it is. <laughs> will you continue to add to it throughout the season, or will it remain the same number for the whole rest of it? I reckon if someone guesses it, we'll give them some money, and, and then you can continue to add to it, and we'll we'll. No, because, um, uh, yeah. Maybe. No, I think we continue adding to it because if some, as people start guessing, the load number will change well, all the time. What, how about this, right? Instead of just adding to it like one or two loads a day, you start a separate bottle and then halfway through the season, you can pour that in and then people can try and guess again. How fuck do you think I am? Dude, you open that bottle, oh. the smell of a thousand corpses. <laughs> it is like, it's like the, it's like the golly bottle. 
It's, 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 I'd like, say it's, it's worse than the gully bottle. No, the gully bottle was corpse. That's fart. No, I don't mind the cum bottle as much. <laughs> yeah, I actually it's really like mince, mince bottle. bottle. It's Sorry, mince. No, nah, yeah, roll with me on this. So when it start, when we started last season, there was no smell for so long, and then one day it just started changing. It's like there was death. Yeah, because it, it went off. The the you your little cells died, little and brown. now it smells like like it's just unbearable. Michael. <laughs> that is legit, everyone. Don't tell anyone though, okay? It's Matt's mince bottle. We can't let anyone find out in any of the platforms hosting what that really is. Have a guess in the comments at how many goes Matt has had in that. How many goes you did in it? I, I can't believe we don't have wireless fucking headphones yet. It's been a fucking rough run, okay? Look, anyway, let's continue the shit talk, all right? We had our holidays and fuck me. We went off the rails, okay? Oh. We, or exactly what we were worried about happening happened. We partied far too hard. Got it. And, and undid all, stopped exercising, mental health went down, w drinking, you know, doing stupid shit. And, and just it, the first week back at work, which was two weeks ago, was rough as fuck. We're still recovering. And right now we are sober. Okay. No alcohol and no drugs. Weed? Fine. On weekends. And guess what? It's Friday. So I will be partaking in some. Naughty. I'm a very naughty boy. <laughs> <laughs> and already, this is day 19, no alcohol or drugs. Feel so much better. Blood pressure was right back high. Week one, two weeks later, it's come back down. It's fucking lifestyle. I'm telling you, cunt. I'm fucking telling you, you fucking cunt. You Luigi fucking cunt. Matt, did not, do, Matt did not do math. Yeah, we had our boys trip and um, it's, we, you know, it, we're sorry to say Matt really did not partake in any of the I didn't drugs. do any drugs. I did I did drink, but I did not do any drugs. Fuck. And, and you, Michael and I have found a new love for ketamine. Oh my oh. God. It's fucking great. And I found a new hate for it. The only reason I hated though is because I had to sit through sober while every single person around me was on ket. And I'm telling you, you'll never hate, you'll never hate your friends more. And when, unless you're so Why? What was so bad about it? It just, you can't, you can't, Talk. like, uh, you know, what's like the attention span of things? Gone. Like, it's like. I remember looking over at Matt and he's just sitting there, just lost on the boys' trip saying, this is not what I fucking signed up for. <laughs> We're here at the Brownery <laughs> too. Yeah. At, his, at his, house. his house? Like, you can't go home. <laughs> but uh, there is an upside to it because if you were drunk and on on other things as well, if I was like, oh, you know what? I'm going to go to bed at like one in the morning. You guys would turn into absolute panic mode and attack. It wouldn't leave me alone for hours. Right. Yeah. But on Ket, on Ket, I'm allowed to just well, do what I want. You should have joined us, Matt. You should have yeah. joined us. Yeah. And then look, we haven't done Ket much until I, the boys trip. And now, yeah. Once again. It's a lot of fun. Once again, I was seeing Lockie in that state just didn't put me in the right spot yeah, yeah you, you saw all of us when you're too fucking drunk yeah you and don't, then, okay, hold don't drink and do cat just do do cat on its own but uh, you know in moderation and then the, uh an another one of our friends had a bad experience right in front of me and i just it's not for me yes yeah, because you just drinking. do it a little bit it's yeah. so yeah don't do it all the time well, but do cat we'll tell our friends that no no no. Because otherwise, yeah, I can't really get there. But anyway, look, we're sober now and I'm going, this is the longest I've done in since I was old enough, since I first started drinking, I'm going a hundred days, no alcohol and no uh, drugs leading up to my wedding. And I'm just going to see what happens. And already I feel very, a lot better. What um, about your bucks? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that's bef <laughs> right before the wedding. So that's when I, well, that'll be after the hundred days. So that's oh, fine. Okay. Are you excited? You're going to get married. Yeah, I am. But like on back to the sobriety, I'm starting to, the older I get, the more I'm like leaning towards just fucking it all off. Hey, it's just not worth it anymore. It's you just, we're too old. You can't. And, and <laughs> if you're in your twenties and you're drinking every fucking weekend and you're getting fucked up, it will catch up with you. I'm telling you, you got to fucking... You got to be careful of that shit, and now, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's just it's hard to stop now. Moderation, gut, anyway. eating like a fucking pig, 
God, no exercise. Once you stop for a bit, it's so it's hard to start up again. kills your motivation and shit. Anyway, back to the boys' trip. We There weren't any wild stories like we usually have. It was kind of shit having it at the brandery because when you have it at another place, you get that excitement when you fucking get there and you're like, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you don't get that here because we're here all the time anyway. Yeah, mm. everyone just rocked up. Oh, hey. We just sat it kind of was like, you know, it did a bit of work on the foot. Like, it was just a bit shit. And the, the canoeing thing that we always go whitewater rafting was shit. And, and like, Can't I don't know, it was probably much. the worst boy. It was still a lot of fun. It was probably the worst boys' trip we've had to date. I think it's a perfect place for it, but it, we need it somewhere else. Ketamine yeah. saved it. Yeah, yeah, look, we still had a lot of fun, okay? The boys' trip is always a lot of fun. Do you understand? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you. All right, we've also hired two new full-time editors, Ryan and Cooper. They've joined the Marty and Michael team. I met them today. Yeah, and they are fucking, we're pumping out some content. Let me tell you, this year, I got a good feeling about this year. We're pump. We're just filming, 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 because we don't need to edit it anymore. And mm. Neither does James. So we're just filming heaps of shit. James is on TikTok now, Chinny Jim. Mm. You can balance anything on his chin it is a truly fantastic skill do you know he did like 20 crates today yeah i was curious about the and we were going to do more but we just need to figure out a way to pile them on top he balanced a soccer goal on his chin and what if you stand on the roof and stand on the ladder on the roof and then you can pile them from there and then you can walk off yeah maybe maybe man god that's what i'm here for fucking hell man um Matt's single. (laughs) (laughs) That's the shittest way. That's the shittest way to say it. So we need. Hang on, Bachelor Brown. They want a fucking explanation. We've got a new segment, and it's called Live Bachelor Brown. Come on in. Yeah, you wish. Okay. God, the. That had me for like a microsecond where I was like, Luke walks fuck in. off. No, look, so Bachelor Brown, as you all know, it did work. But oh. then over the holidays, like Matt had a girlfriend, full legit girlfriend. He got mm. back with his ex and um, things were looking okay. And Matt, what happened? Oh, it, it, it was very, very good. Um, but uh, uh, Leah, being um, a single mother, she wanted to move closer to her family. <laughs> Which, <laughs> oh, <laughs> worst Leo timing. Want family. Leo want family. Oh, 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 Smells like the mince bottle. Oh, yeah. No. That's what I mean. It's it far. literally smells like that. Anyway, sorry. Continue. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, yeah, she wants to move closer to her family for more support. She hasn't got a lot of support in Queensland. And- <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> well, Jen, look. I hope you get fucking divorced. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm not married yet. Now, yeah. at least, now it's time for uh, fresh. Again, look, we're not going to do the Bachelor Brown segment again. This, oh, this would have been so oh, good. But God. would you, if we, if we went, nah, it was dead. Everyone hated okay. that segment well, by the end of last year. We still had Ethan out there. He, what about Ethan? <clears throat> no, well, we started talking to Isla. Would again. you go on a date with Isla? <laughs> oh my God! Have you still been talking to her? Yeah, a little bit. Mm. Um, <laughs> everyone tags me, and anything gets posted. Yeah, I get like at least guys. Keep that. Whenever you no, see no, Isla no, post, no, don't tag Matt. No. No, you have to. Because oh, it'll make good. her want you more too, saying, oh my God, oh my God, there are so many people that want us to be together. Like, wow. Yeah. yeah. <gasps> it's social proof. Oh my God. Milk. Milk. Uh, would you milk her? What? <laughs> if you had to, would you milk her? Oh, if I had to. <laughs> oh my like, God. He said he'd milk her. If Jack the cow helped you, would you help Jack the cow? <laughs> Everyone tell Isla that Matt wants to milk her. No. <laughs> Screenshot, <laughs> screenshot no, this. No, 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 yeah, no, screen no. record that. No, and no. DM it to her. <laughs> I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> okay. No, look, what look. about if root the tree? If root the tree helped you, would you help root the tree? <laughs> Fucking hell. Um, but yeah, I Sorry. did chat to Isla. Yeah. Okay. And so look, and Isla's cool. <clears throat> yeah. So Matt's single now. Unfortunately, is uh, uh, some unlucky circumstances. Isla. But he, He's single again now, single brown, and um, look. By well, mutual well, agreement, single. It wasn't a bad breakup or anything. Yeah, like yeah. That. It, was, it was absolutely. It's like just she has to move away, and that's fair enough. Isn't that right, Brown? Yeah. 
Anyway, so that's enough about that. I'm heartbroken. <laughs> yeah, he is. Um, so the plan for this year, guys, we're going to do a live show for the season finale. Obviously, we're going to get a bigger venue um, so that more people can come, right? We got new segments. We got a new set, as you can see. Uh, things are just on the up and improve. We're going to get more guests on this year, right? And fuck me. It's, it's uh, yeah, we're in for a real treat. So sit, sit down on a, like a chair. We've got a reclining chair. Fuck you. Guys. And then just really get ready to enjoy this shit because fucking this season five is our year, you fucking I thought, So this is not season four. This is season five. This is our fifth year. Fifth. That's crazy. Doing this shit for five years. We'll cross, you know, that's like one sixth of my life and we'll like cross, one tenth of yours. We'll cross 200 episodes, won't we, in this season? <laughs> yeah, we'll get to 200. That's Woo. that's correct, Matt Brown. That's correct. Uh, we're Joe Rogan. Yeah. No. Yes, we are, man. Every yes, day, are, every Matt. night, no. all day, every night. <laughs> <laughs> we're Joe Rogan. Yeah, train by day, Joe Rogan by night. night. All, all day. day. <laughs> <laughs> Should we clip that? No. Be our no. Opening? Oh, okay, sorry. Sorry. Brand no, deals. we can. We Thank will. You. Thank you. None of this would be possible. We have um, two sponsors. We have a third coming on soon, um, Mother Energy Drink. We're still uh, discussing things with them. So they'll be coming on later in the season. But um, standing tall with us, we, of course, have Manscaped and Athletic Greens. So we'd just like to take a second to thank our sponsors. Thank you. <laughs> let's, let's do like like a ten minute silence. Yeah, I reckon a fifteen to twenty. Oh, you minute guys silence. could not do a ten minute silence. I bet you. Anyway, sorry. Well, that was pretty good. We had a bit of a silence then. All right, Manscaped. They they've given they gave me like a whole new thing to say, but like I'm just gonna ignore that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? They what if just, got, <clears throat> look. Yeah. Sorry. No. No. Sorry. <sighs> Manscaped. Are you disappointed with how things are going in life? Yep. Do you get up in the morning and hate yourself and think, oh, I have to go through this monotonous, monotonous day by day torture? Is that you? Well, then you need to listen to me. Do you understand? I need you to sit down and put all your attention on the words coming out of my mouth. Because you are headed for devastation. The time is now. The time to act and change is now. If you don't change now, you never will. There will never be the perfect time to go to manscaped.com and start buying male grooming shit to fix your fucking face. There will never be the perfect time. Oh, I didn't have enough money. Bullshit! Go get a fucking loan. Ask your mum for some cash. Go to manscaped.com, fully actual 20, and get 20% off. They will fix your life. The first step to success is to look like success and right now you look like a drug fucked drag queen cunt tell them to steal 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 manscaped to woolies steal steal they're everywhere now no, no. steal steal money that, that you can pay for their products steal steal money so you can pay for manscaped products it's for women women go and steal have sex have sex for cash have sex for cash and buy some manscaped for your boyfriend <laughs> what I'm trying to say is there's a way out okay <laughs> there's a way out of this and you're not listening to me stop wallowing in self pity sitting there playing with your cock while you're listening to a 50 year old man dressed like Luigi I'm 35 sell your body for money go to manscaped.com and begin the journey to success okay <laughs> fix your shit manscaped.com slash fully actual 20 for 20% 20 off to fix your shit fix it fix it put nails in your shit squish your shit squish your shit in the bricks sell your soul also for women <laughs> <laughs> that was the best one for me ever Athletic Greens You might be thinking to yourself what, What's that? What's that say? What's that talking about Athletic Greens? I don't play sport Well you don't need to Athletic Greens is a health supplement That helps you We take Athletic Greens every day And do you know why? 
do you know do you know why we do that because we've trashed our bodies for decades do you understand years and years of physical abuse drinking poisons snorting chemicals fucking our brains Mm. Athletic greens is one of the only things that is a substitute for n- nutrients that we don't have. Mm. Are you on a bender? Do you drink on weekends? Mm. Well, get athletic greens, okay? It's a satchel. It's a little sachet. You, mm. Your powder, you pour it in a, in a glass, you fill it with water and you drink it. And it's so good for your gut and just for everything, all right? It, makes, it literally gives you a boost of energy and it helps you if you make bad decisions with your food and drink if you're a fucking unhealthy fuck this is perfect for you it's such an easy way to extend your life by a couple of decades man no one's got time to eat like 20 apples and three bananas and heaps of veggies every day you just have this one satchel instant energy boost you feel better job done it's literally, it is, it's, it's so good, all right? And, and Athletic Greens slash Fully Actual, if you subscribe to them, it's like a monthly subscription where they just send you what you need and it lasts you a month, every day for a month, you will get a free travel pack with that subscription. Do you understand? Mm. And the travel pack, it comes with a scoop and you can have it on the go, bro. I put it in my protein shakes. He puts his protein so straight in. Mix it all up, and it's great for your gut. Uh, legitimately, we do have it every day now. We thought, oh yeah, we'll we'll give it a go. We'll see how it is. Uh, I do I do not go a day without it. I had it before had it this, this podcast. Yep. Yeah. every day we have it, and it it helps to take away the damage that you do to yourself. All right, all the damage because a lot of people listening they they make bad decisions like we do. Mm. This will help undo some of that. And you may as well. I, if we had this in our 20s, man, I would have fucking been down in that shit. You fucking cunt. <laughs> if you it. smoke cigarettes, you can have athletic greens and it makes it like you're not having cigarettes. Or less cigarettes. I think. <laughs> can you say that? I think. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 we can say it as long as we end it with I think. Okay. Athletic Allegedly. greens it cures cancer as well, I think. <laughs> no, I'm, I back that. Or maybe right. He backs out, I think. Anyway, Allegedly. Athletic Greens slash Fully Actual, okay? Oh. Uh, just give it a crack, all right? Athletic Greens, it's delicious powder that is very good for you. The guy who invented it was, like, dying, right? He had all these, he was on all this medication. He had, like, Crohn's disease. His gut was fucked. He invented this, and he's no longer on any medications. Joe what? Rogan had, takes it as well. Is he on Crohn's? That's what Crohn's. I mean. When, Something like when that, When I was yeah. saying we're Joe Rogan, he said, we are Joe Rogan. Yeah. Because he does the same as us. Yep. That's correct. Yep. I don't know. Bang! Done! Now- Oh, it's going to start again now. Most single. Most people, right, love horoscopes because they're so accurate, aren't they? They are just like, everything that they say is always 100% true and not vague and generalized at all. It's the future. It is. Cold. It is the future right now. So- I have like can't gotten the horoscopes of like 50 horoscopians and compiled all the data and they sent me weekly horoscopes and I've got one for Michael, for Matt and for Julian. All right? They're three horoscopes types. Did you get yourself on? <laughs> God. Can we call them scorpions? No, yeah. We can't. Okay. Oh. You fucking idiot. Sorry. <clears throat> all right. Michael, you're a Taurus? That's or a, correct. Or a Taurus, as we like to say. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? My, he is a uh, Pisces, oh, which is a fish, I believe. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Is it really a fish? Yeah. I guess that. Anyway. What's Julian? Michael, for this week. Okay, we'll get to that. I'll <clears throat> um, Shh. For Taurus, this week. As you enter the new year, the moon twitches like a fresh corpse which could make you attracted to a close relative. Explore those feelings, especially if it's your sister. Make wildly risky investments with all of your money and don't shower. Use the energy from Jupiter's disagreement with the sun and shit on the sand at the beach. Build a sandcastle around it and tell some children that there's a hidden surprise in the castle. 
Watch on as they eagerly dig into the castle. See their shocked reactions as they discover your shit. <laughs> Sacrifice a cat with a shovel next week. You will get thrush in four days. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> It's kind of shit to hear, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, literally a sandy you shit. Thrush and fall. All right, Julian's now. Julian is a Libra, a okay. Libra, like a library, and a Libra, I believe, is a uh, fox with the ass of a uh, cat. Oh. Okay, I think. Don't okay. quote me on that, Matt. It's a maybe. <clears throat> Jupiter's all fucked off because the sun sold it a weak bag during a festival. So don't cut your shit down too much or Jupiter will snitch on you, the dog. Right now is the perfect time to join a bikey gang and get away with fare evasion on trains. Rip a bong and do a nang at the same time to help Mercury realign its ribs. It ain't weak to speak, except for the next five days. So keep your mouth shut until next Wednesday when you can come out and vent to your mates while on MDMA. <laughs> Oh, that is spot on. It, 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 and like, it does kind of sound like Julian's oh. life. Yeah, holy That's shit. so interesting. <laughs> so far, it's so accurate. Oh. Like, Michael's very accurate. Julian's very accurate. All right, let's see Matt's. So Matty's a Pisces. Or a Pisces, sorry, isn't it? Oh, Pisces. A fish. A fish. A, a Pisces is a fish. Just really. Uh, Saturn's rings pulse with desire. <laughs> which means that you should try to have sex with your family pets. You've weathered the karmic north node, so don't give up on the quest to intimidate the neighbor's children. Effort in this area will yield high results in the future. Continue to blackmail women with provocative pictures you took of them and show a stranger your dick. Massage your swollen prostate to loosen a trapped stool built up within. <laughs> Mars is a fuckwit, so expect no progress in your professional career. Wow, that's so. Mars that's is a fuck with. Yeah, I I agree, man. I mean, yeah, they make it this big deal about going there, but fuck off, fuck off, man. You know, <laughs> fuck off, just fuck off, Mars. Oh. <clears throat> so that's the horoscope segment. Um, and and by the way, guys, just if you have any suggestions for segments, or you want to see some come back, or you hate something, let us know because we've got a whole new list of segments. Some might be shit. We haven't tested it yet, bro. All right? Also, while I've got your fucking attention, cunt, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube. Don't forget to like. Don't worry so much about the comment, all right? Just watch the whole fucking thing through. You can leave a comment if you want. We'd read them all. That'd be nice. Wouldn't it, Matt? you like some reading. Mm. <laughs> and give us a five-star review on Spotify, thanks. Yeah. That's, that'd be, that'd be yeah. good. We're growing. As a community, we're all growing. We're a group of rings growing. By word of mouth, it's beautiful. Let's keep that train chugging along. Matt's the fucking train driver, pouring the coal in the fucking thing, fucking contributing to fucking global warming, you dumb cunt. You fucking coal chugging cunt. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, well, well, well. <sighs> All right, guys. Oh. It is oh. Matt. Matt's Matt. hungry. We could have a lunch. All right, guys, it is now time. For the main segment of this podcast. Matthew vs. Michael, it's Matthew vs. Michael in a competition. Wow, we got to come up for a jingle for that. Oh, you we should just you, do that. You try do one. What? Do a jingle. I'm not good at Come on. This. Have a go, Brown. All right. He's being shy and bashful. Matt and Michael. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'll try. Knock, knock. Who's there? Who's there? Knock, knock. Who's there? I was sitting on my chair. Oh, no. It's Michael. I feel like I could beat that. <laughs> all right. That's even include you. All three Sorry. are very usable jingles. All right. Now, this segment is where Michael and Matt will go head to head against each other. And we will keep track of who is winning this competition all the way to the season finale. So there are, there are going to be 40 competitions in total. The winner will get to keep Matt's bottle of mints. And do with it what they will. Michael, I feel like I'm going to get quite competitive in this i just want to say that at the end i'd still want to be friends oh no i'm scared is this like are we gonna fucking wrestle right now no 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 <clears throat> all right the first competition is a good old-fashioned and you haven't even told us what it is you can't just i'm just uh, about to <laughs> <laughs> I have no, we have no way to prepare you 
Yeah, that's the whole point. Oh. There is no prep for you guys. Fuck. Anyway, the first competition is arm wrestle, arm wrestle, arm wrestle, arm wrestle, arm wrestle. wrestle, wrestle. Now, Matt is left-handed, Michael is right-handed. So to make it fair, they will have a right-handed arm wrestle, then a left-handed arm wrestle. And if it's a tie, they will have a thumb wrestle to decide who is the winner for today. Ah! Oh, no. Here we go. Oh, I hate arm wrestles because I've seen the footy show where the shit... Why do you have to choose arm wrestle? Oh. It's for the greater good. I might just lose. It's for the greater good. On your knees, weapons. Uh, on your knees. This is big. This is the this is the first competition. Holy shit, this is this is exciting as fuck. Alright, I'll try and explain it as best I can for those listening on Spotify. Alright, they're going left-handed first. Alright, don't no whinging, just a normal fucking arm wrestle. I want full power from both of you, alright? Michael's got some wiry, weird weasel strength, no but idea. Matt Brown's got the density of a thousand cows. <laughs> I'm not good at that. Three, two, one, begin! Oh, oh, it's close. It is a deadlock. Oh, my God. I'm going to win. Oh, my God. Michael. All right. Michael has taken a 1 0 lead. He won the left hand. He won the left. left. <laughs> Matt, you just gave up. Yeah, I don't like arm wrestles. Oh, Matt, don't. Don't. You're scared of Wendell Saylor. Yeah. Have you seen that? Dude, that's so rare. That, do you think Michael's strong enough to break your radius on Ulmer? Yeah. 3, 2, 1, begin. Oh, it's close. It's close. Oh. All I right. The first Fucking competition. Hell. All right, guys. That is fucked. There Matt. you have it. Oh, my. I'm. Yeah, this is good. That is the first competition done me. and dusted. Michael has taken a 1 0 lead. I honestly thought I was going to fucking lose that. Yeah, I thought Matt would at least. I thought, look at your arms. They're thicker than dick. Yeah, I didn't even try. I just. All right, look, he's taking you, a quick you know, lead. You fucking make that and you don't want to keep it. You Imagine when you have a kid, you're just going to, oh, fuck that. Oh, I can't even, oh, oh, yeah, have it. Have it, stranger. I've got 40 more. Oh. What do you mean? 38, 39. Have you 100. been, sa- you got to make sure you every, you don't waste them. They all go in that bottle. Dude, I'll overflow it. It's only half full. I can't, wow. I honestly thought I was going to lose that. So yeah. Do I. Or at least be a little bit closer. Anyway, all right. Look, Michael's taken an early lead. The competitions will get more intricate and detailed as we go. Okay, so get ready. I'm also open to suggestions. So leave in the comments if you have any suggestions for a Matt versus Michael competition. Mm. All right, moving along to a brand new segment. Who's the better brown? During the week, we contacted... Other Browns, many other Browns out there. There are hundreds and thousands of them. They all DM'd us and said, I am the best Brown, and I handpicked one. This Brown has the chance to win $200, just like that. Wow, really? Yes. What are they going to do? They have to beat you. They have to beat you, Matt. At what? Being (laughs) better at Brown. A foot race. Come in, other brown. <laughs> That'd be so good. No, I'm going to call him, and then you will have a trivia based on brown. Wow. All right, are you ready, Matt? No. All right, you're gonna you're gonna speak to a fellow brown. <laughs> He's not ready, dude. Imagine talking to someone else with your exact same yeah, last I would name. Freak out. This uh, is like every so, time I talk to my Oprah and Oma, I go, "What the fuck's going on?" Yeah, it's on? like Twilight Zone shit. I've never them. ever met a stranger, a strange Sokolinski. Yeah. Yeah. Course, if there is another song, yeah, that's event. fucked. Up. He's probably yeah, related to fuck you that. Why are you guys saying such things? It's just, it's fucking ridiculous that name. Right, so, but you can see how rare this is. So, this is like you could be related, maybe like ages ago, maybe. What no. if it's your dad? Well, that'd be funny. All right, let's I'd be call. impressed. All right, let's call this Brown and begin the trivia. Hello. Hello, it's Marty. Hello. How are you, mate? Can you hear me? It's Marty. It fucking... Yo, Marty. What's going on, man? You should be able hey, to go, the thing, can you? Yeah, I'm just looking at the questions. All right. Now, um, what is, can you please state your full name? Blade Brown. <laughs> Laid Luffin Brown. Laid, Laid Brown. It's nearly laid down. <laughs> no, it's Blade 
Oh, Blade Brown. Blade Brown. Blade Brown. Blade Brown. Now, now Matt Brown, Blade his last Brown. name, his last name is also Brown. So you guys have the same last name. Would you guys have anything to say Hang to each other? Blade Brown. That's your name. Fuck yeah. Right, so Did you check this? Yes. Wow. Fun. Just a cool name. Oh, yeah. So do you guys So you guys both have the last name Do you have anything to like say to each other You guys could be related or something Matt you, Yeah probably say something, say something only Browns would get Matt um, <laughs> Where's your family from Australia Yeah Perth. but whereabouts in Australia Perth Perth fucking oh. man. So there's Browns They're fucking everywhere yeah. Like a fucking plague Yeah fuck All right. day. Now Browns. I will ask you some brown trivia. All right, five questions. Whoever gets more, if Matt Brown gets more questions right, then Blade, you don't get two hundred dollars. But Blade, if oh, you right. are the better Brown, we will transfer you two hundred dollars of bag money straight into your <laughs> bank account for the weekend. Oh, Fuck yeah! All right, all right, all right boys. Here we go. Good luck, Blade. <clears throat> I reckon you guys can't call each other your first names. It has to be Brown. Oh, so say good luck, Brown. Good luck, Brown. <laughs> good luck, Brown. <laughs> this is so funny. There's two Browns on the phone. <laughs> Be more right. Brown, Brown. First, first question: Millie Bobby Brown suffers from which disability? Blade, you answer first. Is it A? Is it A? Vision impairment. B. Deaf. C. Mental health conditions. D. A collapsed vaginal passage. Um, I'm going for A. A, vision impairment? Yep. Matt Brown? Yep. And no, I'm not repeating Why the what? question. Yep, yep. You fuckers. Deaf. You reckon deaf? Yeah. Oh, no, it's A. A? You're going A as well? No, it's deaf. Final answer? Yeah. Deaf. Matt Brown, you are correct. Matt is on one. Unlucky Blade, right? You got you got to bring this home, Blade. Who's Millie Bobby oh, Brown? Who? Just another Brown, dude. You should fucking know yeah, her. You, I thought you were sisters with her. Idiot. Oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that, no, that's my long lost cousin. Yeah, see, see Blade knows. Blade. Blade. All right. Question, really number two. Question number two. Question number two. How old was James Brown when he died? I will take the closest answer. Blade, you go first. 24. Actually, 24. All right. He should, maybe Matt should answer first because he's in the lead. Matt, you answer first. Nah, can I change my answer? Please? Yeah, yeah. Just let Matt answer first, and then because right. then you'll, you'll have an advantage. Then I don't Blade. think he's dead. You don't think he's dead? No. All right, Blade. <laughs> what do you reckon, Blade? Um, forty forty nine forty nine forty nine right there. The answer is. 73 He is dead So Blade wow. gets one back That's one Fuck all yeah. That's one all with the Browns How many mere comfort yeah, All right question number three When did he die? No, I don't know The largest brown bear Ever found <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Wait listen The largest brown bear Ever found oh. Weighed more Than a convertible Mini Cooper is this true or false, Matt? True. True. Both wrong. It's false. Ooh. The bear weighed 750 kilos and the car is 1,250 kilos. Question wow. number four. It's still one all. This is so close. Yeah, this is good. Please. This is all right. On average, what percentage of shit is protein? Um, <laughs> Brown shit. Brown shit. Um, fuck. Because it's brown. You know, it's brown. It's pretty fucking strong. Like, um, Matt, do you care to 15, answer? Nah. Yep. 10%. All right. 10%. All right. Blade's going 10%. Brown? What percentage is protein mm. in your brown? 2.5. <sighs> fuck. Brown knows his shit. <laughs> the answer is 3%. Oh, Matt Brown is taking what? the lead. It's taking the lead. It's ah. a good Right. You think your body would be absorbing? All right, all right. Here we go. The final all question. Right. Come on, Blade. Here we go. So if you can get this b brown blade, then this is we'll go into a tiebreaker. We have a brown off. Yeah, a brown off. Exactly oh. right. All right. Well, brown. Question number five: Which of these celebrities has brown eyes? <laughs> Kira Knightley, Orlando Bloom, or Catherine Heigl? Um, Is only one? Do I have to go first? Yes. Uh, 
Kira Knightley. All right, Matt has said Kira Knightley. Blade, what do you say? The last one. Catherine Heigl. Sure. All right, you were both wrong. Wrong. Fuck. All of them do. All of them have oh, the you brown didn't give us eye. That option. <laughs> Holy shit! Wait. Fuck so what's the score? Is game. that? Oh shit! Oh, it's wow. two one to Matt. Fuck. Oh, Blade fuck Brown. Blade. Blade. Fuck. All right. Oh, so unlucky, Blade. Fuck. He nearly had him. He's a good Brown. Matt's a very yeah. strong Brown. <laughs> yeah. He's a very strong Brown. The, the powerfulness of his Brown is unheard of. All right, all right, Blade Brown. I'm so sorry. Um, we can't give you the two hundred dollars today, but thank you no. so much for playing along. You. And spread, no, you right, my brother. spread the word far and wide. Matt Brown is the most powerful Brown. If you know any other Browns that want to challenge him, get him to DM us. We Be, will yeah. crown the main Brown by the end of the season. Be safe, Brown. Fuck you. <laughs> right, see, see you, Blade. See you, Blade. Are legend. You yeah, yeah, this is going in the podcast. Yeah, dude, you're on the podcast. This is Brown. Oh, wait, wait. Stay, stay, stay. Listen, listen, listen. Listen. listen, listen. listen. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got you. I got you. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. That was a shit. <laughs> that was very good. That was Brown. <laughs> yeah, my job's to Brown. <laughs> All right, play. Have a bloody great weekend, mate. We'll chat to you soon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. see you, dude. Bye. Bye. Oh, push it. <laughs> That's like sour milk. Smells like the fucking mince <laughs> bottle. Like the mince Nothing bottle. smells like the mince bottle. All right, bottle. that's the that's the brown. That's the who's the better brown. Well done, Matt Brown. Yeah, it's you a good start. That was very brave. You, you need what, to be you, better at the questions. You can't say oh all of them. You need to add that as an no, option. Look, no, you made up for the the look, week. Br- look, Brown. You, that you 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 said you opted to choose. Um, what was it? But I didn't know all of them was a choice. That's the problem. That's a problem with your game. You said yeah, you got to think outside you said, the brown. Yeah, you said the James Brown question. You were like, no, he's not dead yet. Yeah, but once again, you should have gave us the option. No, you, no, you think just have to know. You have to be the better Brown. Okay, I won't. I won't have you discussing the game rules any further. Who's the better Brown? Okay, accept the rules or don't. So sorry, everyone, that you had to see that. But sometimes a Brown just <laughs> needs to, to be put down. <laughs> <laughs> I hate sitting lower than you because you can really just talk down to me and it's fucked. <laughs> our fart eyeline. Our fart eyeline with brown. Brown air, brown put the, lungs. Put the brown down. <laughs> put the brown down, brown. Oh my God. The room is fucked. Hi, guys. Moving right along, okay? We've got a brand new segment. Now, this segment will only be starting next week. This is called Michael's Movie Reviews. Michael's Movie Reviews. Movies. And this is a segment where Matt Brown will select a movie that Michael has to watch before next week's episode. <laughs> and then Michael is going to give us a detailed review. Now, you may remember from last season, Michael doesn't like many of Matt's movie selections. Matt thinks he is a movie connoisseur. He thinks he's good. No. He, you think you you have yeah, good you movie do. taste. You do, Matt. You, you do always say that. talk about movies. Yeah, you I always talk like, about them. I didn't say I'm a connoisseur. Yeah, yeah you have you, said that. You, you think you know your movies. You said that at a funeral once. Highly inappropriate. Matt thinks he knows everything there is to know about movies, so Matt's going to pick a movie How that he you. loves, and Michael's going to review it to let the general public know what it's actually like. So this, yeah, this has to be movies that Brown actually loves, loves and thinks is good. All right, Matt, what have you got for Michael to watch over um, next week? I can't think of the year that it was made, but I feel like it was the nineties. Not that, that. Who cares, really? We want. I'm going to let you make you watch a, a Disney film. And it is. It's the Three Musketeers, but <laughs> but it's the it's. Isn't that got Ven Verdi Bertus the clearest in? It's got Charlie Sheen. It's the Charlie Sheen version. So there's no like and Janus J- Joplin or whatever his name is. Janus Joplin's a singer. You should know that, that. fucking and Barris guy. 
Antonio, Antonio Banderas. Banderas. Yeah, no, that can't. that's a mask of Zorro. <laughs> oh, okay. God. Same movie to me. They are both, I guarantee, shit. <laughs> then you're going to, oh, I should get him to watch Mask of Zorro. No, I've this. seen that and it's shit. <laughs> yeah, well, All right. You watch it again. So, But it's the it's the Kiefer Sutherland, Charlie Sheen version. What year? And so it's what? It's like 90s. Okay, oh, so, so it's old. Uh, sh- show me it. It's like 90s. Do you, do you even have something you can play that? No, no, no. It's we'll get him to. DVD. You can, can download, download it. it He'll download something. it. So it's got the old parental like, guidance like symbol like so the old like they've all got that for, you dickhead it's not, every film has a guidance yeah yeah but not it's got the old style it hasn't got color coding like the fucking yellow one it looks old so this is probably from the 90s what right? are you talking about well you know how you got the m now that there's the classic m but then now the the new m is it's got blue in it i don't want you to talk about that anymore anyway uh, i can uh, promise you just by looking at this cover, and this is also, this is a guaranteed, this isn't a theory. Any movie that is PG is shit. It's shit, it's shit, it's shit. It's like, there's no there's no adult jokes. There's no risque shit. It's just like boring and shit. You like, need, there's it's, heaps it's of a PG kid's film. film. Right? I'm going to watch a fucking kid's film. You like the Sandlot kids. <gasps> okay, Sandlot, okay, okay. That's PG. <laughs> Sandlot kids Probably G. is still sort of shit as an adult. Sound like kids Shut is good up. as a kid. Shut anyway, up. Look, 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 look. We're, we're not going to know what you truly feel about the movie until you watch it. So Michael's going to watch it and then next week he's going to give a detailed review and we'll finally see what he thinks of the movie for real. I avenge you, father. All right. It's going to be good. All I right. fucking promise you it's not. All right, guys. We're going to have a cheeky bong break and we'll be right back with the lying segment because Lockie has no idea that we're filming the podcast right now. Bong break. It's we're, a decline. We're gonna, yeah. we're gonna uh, call f- Lockie now, and we're gonna lie to him. He has no idea that we're recording the podcast this week. Let's just say, um, let's say, oi, we're coming to the coast for the week on the week. No, tonight. no. Tell him we're doing another boat trip day, and we get we're hiring a boat next week. Does he want to come on? Oh wow! Yes, yes, yes. It's yes. back. It's back. Look in the sh- camera. Sh- <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's gonna reek too. Yeah, it's because I've been eating to poo poo all day, and I've <laughs> haven't so that I can do that for you. It's all for you. <laughs> Everything I do, I do is... it's all for you. Um, so I reckon we tell him that we're going on another fishing trip. Do you want to come? Jack, we'll get Jackson as well. He loves. Well, why don't we say something trips. even just tonight? Like, oh, dude, we've um, we're coming to the coast tonight. Um, he'll he'll pick up on that. We're coming to the coast tomorrow. Late. We're coming to the coast tomorrow uh, because we have something going on there because we have a meeting there. I reckon if we give him time, because he could have plans this weekend. If we say, look, next Thursday we're coming down, we want to do um, another boat trip. Are you down to come along? Simple, easy. Get some, oh, he'd be excited. He had a good time with us last time. We build it up, say, yeah, we're going to bring some weed. We're going to get high. Um, <laughs> okay. Look, we might even do some ket again. We'll, we'll mention the ket. <laughs> and then we tear him down. Oh. We hurt him and we say, mate, Everything that you, we said is a lie and it's not happening. We're going to see you for probably a few weeks, maybe a month. Before you say it, and let's really band together to destroy him here. Yeah. Well, you, you're just doing the call. We jump in once it's yeah, a lie. Yeah, so we all need to work together to really make sure that he knows that he's made a grave error here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh. You have reached the message. He will call back. Anyway, one of them will call back and we fuck, we, we hurt them. All right. Well, um, we hurt them. Should we move to, um, just want to get the Q and A explanation out of the way. I can't I've got to watch the three Musketeers. <laughs> How long does it go for? Like two, Not too long. I'll watch it with you if you want. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Is it three hours that movie? No, it's like an hour. Three and hours. Half. It'll be an hour and a half. Oh, oh and God. The runtime will be on the back of the cover. All right, look, we're going to wait for Lockie or Greg to call back everyone. All right, we're going to move ahead with the podcast, but we'll circle back around when they call. We'll drop everything to answer their call. All right, moving right <laughs> along. Next, we have 
We don't have the Q&A this week because obviously it's the first episode back. So if you'd like us to answer your questions, please comment on the Mighty Michael Fully Actual YouTube channel. We answer the most liked questions first. So after you comment your question, have a scroll through and like the questions that you want us to answer. Uh-huh. Post okay. your questions. The Brown will read them. But for now, we are going to have a look at our P.O. box because we got sent some shit over the holidays, baby. Oh, no. <laughs> Say raise the roof, man. Raise the roof. Raise baby. the roof. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Right. Sorry, I went too far. All right, yeah. first we have. So this is a package for Bosley. Oh. So oh, he should be Bosley here for package. this. All right, I'll go get him. I'll Bo- go get Bosley. Bosley. Doors are closed. He doesn't know. Oh, he's sleeping right now. Yeah, he is. He's having a nap. All right, we'll, we'll open we'll it for him. him. We'll he's entertaining him. our guests. Oh, what? Is he going to Oh, there's fucking treats, cunt. Oh, my God. Ra- oh, That's raspberry not for licorice. That's for us. Raspberry, it's so- That's not for Bosley, surely. This yeah, no way. This is intense, though. This is not a good smell, what I'm smelling. What is it? It just smells like dog shit. <laughs> oh. Okay. Is this safe to eat? Read the card first. Before you eat anything, read so, the card. To Marty lace. and Michael- it's Liam. I have been messaging you guys on Instagram about my pop and mo- and most recently my mum. I just wanted to say thank you guys for everything and your videos have gotten me through a very hard time. This is a gift for Bosley, but yours is coming. Thanks again. Love you guys. P.S. I will send a photo through Instagram of my TikTok and Instagram. Would love a follow back. Dude. Yes, we will follow you back. Do we? Yep. Have, just keep an eye out for his DM, I yeah, suppose. I will. I will. DM us again on Instagram and just let us know that it was you. And we will find you on TikTok and follow you, okay? Let's keep looking through these. Thank you, Liam. Thank you, Liam. Treats. Thank you, Liam. Wow. So he's, he's got, got like a dog. Look, he's got tusks. Oh, he's is gonna, that a little shirt for Boss? Oh, that? Yeah, wow. Boss, he's going to love this, eh? Is that chocolate? He was literally safe? smelling this package when we brought it through the door. He chocolate knew. Safe? I think so. I had yeah. some. I think it's dog chocolates. Oh, yeah, it is too. It's dog chocolate. (laughs) (laughs) It's legit dog chocolate. You're not meant to eat dog chocolate. Yeah. You dickhead. I actually ate a bit. It's actually not that bad. Mm. 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 (laughs) We have have a squeaky toy. Oh, Bozzy's going to love that. He's probably, look, if that, if is that door open, the glass door? No. He'll probably come to the door now. Got chicken feet things? Yes. Look, 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 there he is. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm gonna go get him. Here More he shit comes. For Bosley. Watch the cords. More Here shit for comes. Bosley. Who's a little Bosley? Who's a little Bosley? Toys. Who's a little Bosley? Look at this. More toys. <laughs> what the fuck is that? A little, little horseshoe thing. <laughs> oh, he's overwhelmed. Yeah, Boz. Fucking more treats for Boz. Like this, eh? Oh, oh what's that? Huh? What's that? What are these? What Some, are these? Dehydrated chicken hearts. Are you fucking kidding me? Something there. Oh, there you go. Boom. You're like a Santa sack Good or some shit. boy, a Boz. shirt for Bosley. A little shirt for him. That's beautiful. Hey, there's a lot of shit in there. Like, <sighs> Squishy oh, ball. Caramel. Caramel oh. eggs. Oh, some oh man, I'm going the I'm off the rails. Hey, I'm the such bottom. a piece of shit. Oh yeah, we're mm. wallowing in our sickness. Clifnonic, mm. mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> dude. Thank you so much, Liam. This is outstanding work. Bosley, can you please thank Liam? Say thank you, Liam. Thank you, just Liam. wag your tail if you understand me. Good boy. Good boy. Bye. All right, one more. And then we'll save the rest. I think this we only got two more. Sorry. Oh, what is this? Wow. It's a, it looks like a oh, shirt. Someone did tell me they were sending a t-shirt in. Is that a shirt? Yeah. Is there a note in there? Oh, there is a note. Bosley's so keen for shit. Look at him. No, there's no note in there. Wow. What? A, whoever fucking made this for us, thank you. Because holy shit, it's us. What does it there's say? There's no better shirt. Than us, <laughs> than having uh, what our does it say? On. Mine house, mine house, mine house, my neck, <laughs> which is my neck Very in German. Very good. 
Very Mine good has. PO box. Oh, wow. Look, you're next. <laughs> oh, my God. There's a picture on the shirt of me yeah. with a really long neck. <laughs> that is a very good mm, show. Well That's done. the best thing we've been sent in a long time. Ever. <laughs> oh, can the person who sent that let me know? That's who's the best thing we've ever shout. been sent, I think. And, Holy shit. Right, very fuck, good. What, do you want this last one done? Be mindful. Is yeah, that go note, on then. Does that note have one. anything bad on it before you look at it? I don't think so. I think this is a no young, a young child. I'm worried about what's in this. Just be mindful. It could be. Thank oh, go slow, so dude. Thank you so much, everybody, what disgusting for sending that in. All right. So lastly, we have a little, little packet. Looks like some cords in it's there. Like tech stuff. Like that's. A Give me a look at that. It's tech, Matt. It's tech. <laughs> <laughs> we got sent tech, Matt. <laughs> it's a tech deck. All right, there's a letter to go with it. Let's see what they want with this tech. <laughs> it's a triangle. To, Ma Marty. to, to, to Marty, Marty and Michael, and Michael. Hope, hope you guys are liking <laughs> the headphones. This other gift yeah. is for the headphones. If someone else would come on as a guest, so glad that the fully actual podcast is out. Sorry, you boys are the best legends, the funniest in the whole wide world. Keep up the good work make your pause roars happy with a smile in their races from Haley. Thank, thank you, you so thank much Haley. and now look now it's a bull skull so now look <laughs> Haley. Uh, i believe Haley's one to send us headphones a while back so that's because okay. remember how we, we always have one headphones that's i don't know there's been like difficulties or We've something sorted that all right but Haley, this will now go up on the castle the, with the, the Castle Tremaine. Yeah. It'll join. <laughs> <laughs> the Castle Tremaine. Can you put on the Castle Tremaine? <clears throat> Just around the A or something. <laughs> yeah, that makes me happy. Ring around the A. <laughs> Ring around the A. Wow, that feels good. I didn't eat too much chocolate, so thank you, Liam. That's all you needed to eat. All right, thank you, everyone. And if you want to send us something on the P.O. Box, please send it to P.O. Box 256 Tagum, 4018, Queensland, Australia. Okay, we open it live on the podcast. If you want to, you got a business, you want us to promote something, send it in. We'll have a look at it and shit, man. And give us some shit metal. Eat it. A brown. Oh, calm down. We. Brown Leland. Just because I've ate a couple of things, it doesn't mean I'm going to eat oh, anything. Oh, it kind of does mean that. All right. <laughs> Guys, it's time. We're, we're feeling a bit rusty, first episode. Oh, like, it, it is it feels, good to be back, though. It feels a bit. Um, Disjoiners, not as smooth cock. It's flaccid cock with bend in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All yeah. the skin's balled up at the base. <laughs> There's lots of bumps oh. to get to the smooth knob of the Jeez. podcast. <laughs> so bear with us while we find our bare rings over the next few weeks. <laughs> <laughs> yes! 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 Everyone be quiet! It's lucky! It's lucky! It's lucky! <clears throat> hey, dude, can you hear me? Yeah. Hello? Hey, man. Um. <laughs> Or just a quick one where do you remember that video we did um how we went like we hired a boat and we went out fucking fishing for the day yeah yeah we're doing that again next week are you and jacko free next wednesday or thursday um i have to ask jacko because okay. he's got a new schedule now but i think that should be fine okay sweet yeah because we'll just we're gonna get like a bigger boat this time and um we'll get a few other people and like we're gonna yeah we're gonna like actually get like a massive boat and um we'll bring heaps of weed and shit and just make it really weird yeah that'd be fun well who's gonna drive the boat well, well i think we we're get, no I, th I think we're gonna hire someone or james <laughs> got a boat license i don't know Do you, will we <laughs> if we hire one of the big ones we'll need a oh true actually me and Jackson just get under our names and James can drive it. 
Oh yeah, yeah, all that because it's pretty easy to drive. We're probably going to do some fucking um, bag and shit as well, and let's probably. just let's just get fucking fly like Kyle Schlintler. Yeah, I'm keen for bag and weed. All right. Mix, but it'll work. all right, we'll ask Jacko which day suits, and we'll I fucking think. and we'll fucking um yeah we'll book something in. Lovely mate. All right, all right dude. Well, guess what, cunt? <laughs> you can lie to. Fucking idiot! Oh, we're back! Yeah. Fucking we're cunt! Back. <laughs> we're back! We're back, cunt! We're back! Fucking, fucking cunt! Never sleep! Oh my god. You thought god. you were gonna have fun, but we're probably not you gonna see just... you for about a month. Oh, you can't just always tease me with fucking like heaps of drugs. It's just the way you fucking really hit. Oh, you've got heaps of bag and weed. Oh. No, no, we are coming down, but we're not doing drugs. Oh, it all starts again. Another year of this shit. <laughs> oh man, we well, got lied to so bad then, bro. You were like so excited. He's pumped up, fucking fist pumping and shit, doing the fucking Melbourne shuffle. And then we dropped the hammer cunt. There is no boat, bro. There is no boat. <laughs> there's no boat or drugs? Or is there's, no, there's there, there is a boat, there's but nothing. we're not doing drugs. There's a boat, but we're not doing drugs. We're going to do like just a fun video. Oh, fuck that boy. Lie to him, lie to him, lie to him. Lie to him. <laughs> Secondary lie. <laughs> Double no, lie. We're not, we're not seeing you for probably a month or two, can't. <laughs> oh, mate, well, I'll see him off too, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to waste your time, Loggy. We'll chat to you soon. <laughs> see you next week. <laughs> right, right, mate. Oh, man. Oh, oh man. That, that was a good was ending. Good. We fucking good. got that, that was very good oh, ending. I've nearly lost my fucking voice yelling at that can, eh? Oh, <laughs> like, I was yeah, yeah, full yeah. of hate then, bro. I was, like, yeah. fucking so Feels angry. Feels good to, like, just lash out so at a mate. fucking angry. It's yeah, fucking I did hell, feel like, a bit of energy off. go oh, through it me. feels nice. Try that out. If you were a friend, just fucking lash out at him. It definitely helped with the depression of sitting on this mat. Yeah. Let's call Greg. Mat on a mat. Let's call Greg. Yeah, yeah. Okay, same thing, but on the Saturday. <laughs> fucking hell, he's being so disrespectful. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, Greg. <laughs> Fuck you, Greg. Hi, you've reached Fuck. Greg from Match Point Center. <laughs> leave him. Right, him. Leave him. Right now, please leave a message and I'll get back to you shortly. Thanks. Uh, hey dude um, Sorry to bother We're just trying to book in um, A day of filming And We'd like you to be there If possible If you're free Next Saturday Give me a buzz back Because we're going to hire A boat And just go out like Fishing And just doing stupid shit Big dumb Dump in the ocean I'm going to take a fucking Massive black shit In the ocean You fuckwit I'm gonna fucking shit all over the fucking floor of the boat and roll you, roll roll around in it, you fucking cunt. Oof. Who <laughs> 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 is listening to that? Go. Ooh, I don't think I want to come. <laughs> I don't think I want to come on that. <laughs> <laughs> I wish we could see Greg's face. I wish you could see Matt's on the ground. Oh, God. Matt's on the ground. All right, guys. Mm. All right. As you know, we haven't done a prank call for a long, long time. Oh, wow. Fuck. We're still in there yet. Yeah. It's our final segment, guys. Final segment of episode number one. It's only been an hour and 15, so yeah, we've got good. heaps to cut, too. That's so good. That's very good. Sorry. It's clear, it, felt long, it feels longer on this four. Yeah, we're not used to it. <laughs> we're not used to the podcast. Oh. We've had an eight week break mm. or 10 week break. We're told we don't know what we're doing anymore. Blah, <gasps> blah, blah. <laughs> I will now call the Brisbane City Council because we, I think they've accidentally sent us this thing. I'm going to call the Brisbane City Council and talk to them about some letter that they put in our fucking thing. Sorry. What I suburb is Glenelgan? Sense. South Brisbane. Man, this fucking shirt doesn't fit around my fat. <laughs> <sighs> All right, here we go. Here you go for one. <laughs> Good evening, Brisbane City Council. This is Anne. How you going, Anne? Um, look, uh, my name's Darren. Um, I've just come home. Like, big day work, right? Um, check my box. Um, taking something inside. Letter here from Brisbane City Council, right? Um, and it says here, right, there's um, some, I've got some, like, amount, pa amount payable down here. It says $248.40, right? And it's is got... Is that your rate? 
thank you. I don't know. I, I literally don't know. Like what? What none what? of this? What's none of this is for? It says here. Like listen to this. Like it's got descript description. Right? It says here description, and it says underneath it, uh, ad- advertor advertising advertising right and then it's got them two dots advertising a- annual annual re- renewable approval fee like like what can what you, even is that what even is that do you know you, what I mean? can i ask you a question please yeah sir? yeah go for it bro okay so do you run a business do you uh have a business that has an advertising sign Mate, no, I do, I do like cashies and that. Like, I do um, heaps of cashies, uh, like for labourers so and builders and that. A couple of my mates own like a um, punting, like a yeah, um, a betting uh, thing. And I do like, I do like a bit of uh, cash Karen, collecting for that and that. Yeah. Is the letter addressed to you? Uh it says here, like at the top, it does not say my name. It says, it says I C Church Limited, right? So it doesn't even have my name on it. Do you know what I mean? So, so I'm like. Is that- is that you? No, no, it's, I see I'm Darren. Church Limited. No, I'm Darren. Yeah. I'm okay. If the letter doesn't, if the letter isn't addressed to you, then so the letter is addressed. Oh, hang on, to hang on. I just seen here. I just seen on the front bit. It says permit. It says advertising device. And now I yes. don't, I don't use any like signs yep. and that. Like anywhere okay. near more, more more places of uh, work and that, so like it Darren, must be a mistake. Do you know what I'm saying? Dar- Darren. Yeah, 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 what yeah. Name is the letter addressed to, please. Okay, it says I C Church Limited. Like I don't even know what okay. that means. I don't even know if what that means. If that's needs. not you, then you need to seal the envelope back up, oh, shit. and you need to write return to sender. Oh, shit, mate, not you've taken address. Do you know what so I think I've done? I, I might have actually de- taken. I might have accidentally taken the neighbour's bloody mail. Oh, okay, shit. so Hang on, it, let me have a quick look at the out the front of the mailbox. I think because oh, it's shit. clearly not not for you. Yeah, no. Oh shit! I, I actually have. I've taken it from number fourteen. Oh, okay, I'm so num- just I'm number twelve. Oh, I better put it put it back in the envelope. Put it in their letterbox, oh, Darren. Put it back in. Oh, oh shit! I've just. Um, well, if you can't put it back in, just stick the letter in the letterbox, mate. I, I, I kind of panicked and tore, tore, it, tore it to pieces. Uh, hang on. Oh, shit. Oh, maybe I can sticky tape that back together. Fuck. Yep. Oh, stick what? it back together um, and put it in their letterbox. And and was it? Um, if I if I don't, you can't say nothing. Don't tell no one about this, and you promise me. No. If if you've opened Do you promise it accidentally, me, I'm, I can't. I can't get done for this. All right, I'm like on parole on that. I can't get done for like mail. Darren, I theft don't. And that. It, I don't think it's an issue that you've accidentally opened someone's oh, mail, I mate. Oh, I don't know. It's got to, it's got a bill on it and that, and I've just gone and snooped their bloody mail. I've I've got a couple of other bills. You've I've thrown it. in the bin. I've thrown them in the bin already. You've I'm done bit. it accidentally, mate. Yeah, just, yeah, no. Just go and get some. Uh, just go and get some sticky tape. Like and you know, oh, you know, I've ripped it together. into I've ripped, I've ripped it into about fifteen pieces. It's hard. to... Okay, well, if you I've if you can't do that, it. if they if they don't receive their if they don't receive their notice, then they'll contact council, Darren. Right. Okay. So I don't need to lock. So you and me, right? We we take this to the grave with us. You and me. Lock. I'm not going to. Get to the grave, oh, and, and on, before you go, I need you to tell me, like, I will die for you, right? If you stay loyal to me, and I'll do anything you want. I've got your back till the day I die. I promise it. I'm Darren, Darren Thompson. I'm Darren Thompson, and I swear it underneath the Southern Cross and other all the An- Anzacs. Think about what them Anzacs done, right? That's me. I've got that coursing through me. Darren, so if you if yeah, you look, keep I- this a secret, I promise you, darling, you will never ever need to worry about nothing again, right? I will walk your dog. You got a Darren, dog? Darren, I don't. I, I do have a dog, but if oh. you've accidentally opened someone's mail, I don't think you need to panic, mate. And I've ripped it I into about okay. 20 pieces, though, Anne. Like, you don't understand. I panicked and I ripped it up. Yep. I shredded it. And it's half okay. of it's out on the front door. If the neighbours come out right now, they'll see me all bloody shaking, shaking shaking like a bloody leaf with their bloody bills yep. all bloody ripped, ripped up in yep. front of me, you know. Bloody I see Darren, church, my neighbour. Just, just pick it up, mate, and... Put it in the bin. Put it in the bin. That's all you've okay. got to do. All right, all right. Look. All you've got to do. That they they will. Um, they'll realise that they haven't received their their bill, um, and you know they can um, they can let us know. But what what address was it actually delivered to? 
uh, f- 14 Glenelg Street or something, right? And I'm like 12. I'm like the yeah, one next door to it. Sub- what suburb are we talking about? South, Br- South Brizzy. South Brisbane. Yeah, South Brisbane. And can you just tell me the name that was on the letter again? Or what was it again? It was like something weird. I think it was like um, I I C Church or some some shit like that. But don't, okay. remember, don't say anything though, Ian. Don't write it down or nothing. It's all, you and I never it, spoke, all right, Ian? I've got you, Ian. I've got you back to the day I die. I promise on my heart and blood. You are coursing Darren, through my blood right now. You, you are my spirit. You're my spirit. You, you, Darren, you won't get in trouble for this, mate. You don't know it's that, It's a man. simple mistake. It's as simple as that. And we have and to so be careful, can... man. We have to be careful. You well, cannot tell well, anyone this, all right, Anne. I'm, I'm just going to put your mind at ease, Darren. You don't have to worry, mate. <sighs> okay? okay? Right, pick just all the pick it up. <sighs> just pick it up. Put it in the bin. Maybe next time, just make sure you look at the name. In, in case it's not for you, okay? Yeah, yeah, no, no. I, I've got to check the All numbers right. from now on. Do you know what I mean, Anne? But look, yeah. Okay. You promised me, All though, right. You promised me you got my back, right? I, I haven't got your details, Darren, so I can't say that you've opened it, okay? No, but you you promised so, me, right, if this if push comes to shove, right, you got my back. If we get back into a corner, I need to know that we've got the same story, right? So if the cops do come calling you, what are we going to say? What are you going to say? Because I'm going to say same no thing as you. Because they're going to cross check. I oh, know, right? I oh, know they're going to cross check. They're, they're going to take you in a Darren. room. They're going to take you in a room and ask you all sorts of questions, right? Darren, we need to this get our conversation story started. is going a little bit scary. There is no reason for the police to contact me regarding someone else not receiving a letter. And okay? I've been throwing their mail in the bin for six months, all right? I've only okay, just well, realised, I've only just realised I've been taking their yeah. mail and, and ripping it up and throwing it in okay, the bin. Okay, well, now you know, Darren, you won't do that anymore, so that's all no, good, No mate. way, no way, Ann, I won't do this okay. no more. I promise you, all right? And all as soon right. as this lease ends, I'm out of here, all right? I'm gone. I'm okay. going to North well, Brizzy or something. Up north. I wish you all the best, Darren. And I love you, all right. I love you, you with all night. my heart. Okay, I've have got you. Night, you've got. Mate. I love you so much, and say it back, please. Uh, say it back, Darren. Uh, Darren, I've got to go now, Just mate. Just tell me I you love me, you. Anne. I love you, Anne. Okay, I'll walk your dog. What do you want, Darren? It's been lovely to speak to you. It really, really has I been. I love you so and much, and I don't Anne. want you. To- I don't want you to stress, but I need to go now so I can help other people. Okay. All right. No, that makes all sense. Right. All right. You remind me of my okay. mother. Very, very helpful, oh. loving lady. All right. All right. You, you take care, Darren. Good night. You are my brother in blood, and I love you to the day I die, and Goodbye. 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 To the day I die. <laughs> 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 oh my god. She, was, she was like the best girl ever. She was the most. That is someone that you want as your That's mom. A girl. Oh, and <laughs> we just spoke girl. to a girl. <laughs> we spoke to a girl, man. Imagine when Greg yeah. listens to his voice. <laughs> <laughs> we spoke to a girl. We spoke to a girl. <laughs> Oh god, that was, so, that was so good, dude. That was so cringe. I realized I need a book to write things down because, like, <laughs> oh, it's hard to voice it to you when the flick lines and the blank. <laughs> fuck, Dad. All oh. right, guys, that is oh, the end. Thank you, Darren. Of thank episode you. number one. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and give Questions. us five star review on Spotify. We'd love you all. We're we're not quite the best this week, right? We understand. It's where it's always a bit rickety. On a we're a bit fucking like a bumpy cock. Yeah, but we're still fucking awesome. Yeah, yeah, we're not mm. quite the best, but we're, I reckon, two, three weeks tops, we're back at the top. Mm. Don't go anywhere, cunt. This season's got so much shit going on. I'm a fucking cunt. I'm on the floor.